hey guys welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a little bit different my recovery has not been so smooth and you guys will see that in the video i did a day by day like diary series if you're interested in seeing how my one week recovery has been keep on watching Today is one day post surgery and I'm feeling okay. Um, <clears throat> I got up to like take these stuff off my hand. <clears throat> um, I did get um, I did get some bruises yesterday because. Yesterday they could not find my veins. <coughs> they were hiding. My voice is <coughs> still raspy. My throat is still sore. Um, I'm about to change the pad that I have on. I've not changed it since all night because it's not like full. <coughs> um, but yeah. So just wanted to, <coughs> you know continue to bring you guys along just for you guys to see you know what it's like um but yeah the arm where i got the bruised this arm hurts more than this arm they try to get blood from both places but i don't know what was up yesterday i was the only surgery patient yesterday it's a small hospital it's not it's not big and everyone just wanted to do something so everyone was like crowded in the room trying to do something so i felt like a whole other experiment yesterday but in a good way they didn't do anything bad but <clears throat> yeah oh my voice i'm home alone today um husband went to work It's just like pink spotting right now. It's nothing too much. Yesterday the bleeding was heavy, of course. So it's done. Sorry y'all. We got our little LED light thing. I'm currently edited in yesterday's video um because i have to like edit stop it stop i'm not sure when i'm going to put it out four hours has run off since i took my last pill i'm supposed to take two tablets by mouth every four hours as needed so i'm about to take two more i have the two pills Oh, all right, I'm about to lay up in this bed again. Oh, I sound better. I feel a little bit better when it comes on to my throat. I'm still feeling tenderness, um, like where the cuts are. I did take um one of the stool softener pills, so I'm gonna take another one today i've been pretty much sleeping all day you guys i got up probably like an hour ago i've been walking around the room um normally friday saturday is my laundry day because on fridays and saturdays i'm off from work but i've not done anything because i can my belly the incisions it hurts so husband will be doing all of that sometimes when you go through these stuff you know it's just a test your marriage and you know test how strong your relationship is and ever since we lost the baby in december honestly my husband has been a rock star so he's been doing his husband duty hey guys good morning so today is february 19 it's two days post surgery and um 
feeling like crap today. Yesterday, my bleeding somewhat went away, but today it came back. Not too heavy though, but I'm watching it. I don't know what I did yesterday, but yesterday when I was coming off the bed, I think I stretched too much in my lower belly where I have that other incision. I, I think I heard it. My throat, it's hurting again. Yesterday I was okay. Like yesterday I was fine. But for some reason, today, not so fine. I'm not showered yet, you guys. I'm not even gonna front. Yesterday I did take a little sponge bath, but I've not showered. Um, the bruise on my hand did get um, a little bit darker. The only thing right now that I'm concerned about is the bleeding. But I think it's normal, but yesterday I got a call from the hospital. They were checking up on me and they were like, um, you shouldn't be bleeding too much. And at the time, I was just spotting. If it gets heavier, I'm going to try to get in touch with the fertility doctor or just go straight to the emergency room. Good morning, guys. So today is, I believe, February 20th. February 20th and it's 9.38 oops and I'm just coming on here just to let y'all know how I'm feeling um 17 so it's three days post um surgery still feeling the tenderness in the areas where I had the incision yesterday I felt a little bit nauseous I didn't throw up but I felt a little bit nauseous and I was bleeding um, a little bit more. I wasn't soaking a pad or anything like that, but I just felt like, okay, is this normal? And <clears throat> I don't have my follow-up until this Thursday, today's Sunday. So four more days until my follow-up visit. But right now that I'm talking to you guys, the bleeding did went back down. Right now it's like um, spotting. Um, like light bleeding to spotting so that's good I did went to number two yesterday <laughs> um, since Thursday yesterday um, was my first time doing number two TMI I know but um, they told me that the medicine that I will be taking will cause constipation surgery and I feel I feel like crap for the first two days my pee it hurted but I was peeing um I was peeing blue and the blue is the dye so now my pee is back to the yellow color normal color right now I'm just over this <laughs> like and also i've been bleeding i've been bleeding like a period um no clots or anything like that but um i've been bleeding since the surgery um right now i have a pad on but hold on y'all i gotta pee again <sighs> If I wasn't feeling the pain when I pee, I'll be okay. Like, it will be like, you know, I'm okay, everything, but it's the pain. I feel like pain again.
I'm gonna go back into bed. I'm gonna hug up on my husband and try to just go to sleep and just wish Thursday would come tomorrow. But I'll see you guys in two more days. Hey, good morning, YouTube. Good morning. You know, take a minute. You know, tell them you'll be in bed. Good morning guys, so we finally made it to one week. Today is February 24th. It hasn't been a smooth recovery. I have my appointment in a little bit with the fertility doctor. When it comes on to the bleeding seven days later, the bleeding is still there. It's not flowing like how it was flowing for the prior days. So it's there, but it's I'm not feeling the pattern, let's just say that. And then every now and then I'll spot. When it comes on to the burning sensation that I feel when I pee, um, this morning um, I went to the bathroom and I felt it, but it, it wasn't so um, bad as the prior days. It just had a little bitty sting. But I honestly feel like it's a UTI because I shouldn't be burning and it's only when I pee. So I feel like there's a little bit of inflammation up there. So today when I go see the doctor, I'll ask him, I'll let him know how I've been feeling. I also Googled how I've been feeling. Google said UTI. So um, basically some women have a reaction from the Foley catheter. I'm guessing I'm a part of that because it really hurts you guys other than the bleeding and the burning i'm totally fine my throat is fine um the bruise on my hand um that's how it looks this is pretty much it for this video thank you so much for tuning in if you're new here and you've not subscribed i would love to have you subscribing is free and i would really appreciate it but if not that's okay if you did like this video please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up i am still a small little channel and you know it takes time to grow i'm not trying to rush the process so guys thank you so much for tuning in and i'll see you guys in another video